So, today is the 5th of January 2021, my birthday. Happy birthday to you. And to top off the best birthday present, we were at the gym and had my headphones going and all of a sudden through my headphones, had a message from the macaw breeder and guess what? Four weeks time, my macaw is coming. <laughs> Got the bit of the teary excitement. Oh. You excited too, Captain? Captain is um, just off his tablets too. Come have a look at Captain. He's looking quite nice at the moment. It's only four weeks to prepare. Even though I've been getting stuff along the way, I had to go get some mm, over here, some nuts and bolts and stuff. So we've got. First of all, these are for the brand, the perches in the cage. Um, come this way. So it's not good to have your bird on this dowel that the page comes with. It's not the best for their feet. It's better to have like more of like, see like this one? Like a natural sicker perch for your bird. So supposedly if you keep them on this stuff for a long period of time it can like damage their claws, give them little ulcers in there, of course. So, we went on a hunt, me and Dex, on our walks, and we've been collecting some big branches. This one, I'm not too sure, this one might be a little bit too thin, but we're gonna give it a shot anyway. Um, it's really crappy weather at the moment, but we will go look for some more. So what we've gotta do is, to make these usable in the cage, don't worry about that. <laughs> to make these usable in the cage, we have to treat the timber first. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna measure this branch up for how I want it in the cage. Then to treat them, it took me quite a while to figure out, to find the information on how to treat the branches before they put them in, because I just thought that I could just put them straight in. But I found one place and it was explaining that you have to soak them in a bleach solution so it's not full bleach it's only like a quarter of a cup in a whole bathtub of bleach because yes bleach is dangerous to birds but you soak them in that first and then you take them out and then you soak them in plain water for 24 hours and then after that you lay them out in the sun to kill the rest of the bacteria you can use vinegar they said but the vinegar doesn't kill all the bacteria that can be found in wild birds which could be potentially on your sticks so once all that's done, then you get these things. They're called hanger bolts. I just got these from our local bunnies. They go into there, and the bolt and washer goes onto that. If you have a look here, you can sort of see this is one that we bought. And you bolt onto like that. Um, these ones I got, most of my toys and stuff I've been getting from the same place I get this from. Also, just came in some food for my birdie. Um, also, they threw in some of, they didn't throw that in, Declan's been playing Nerf gun wars. And then they threw in some of these things. You can buy like a whole pack of them too for the bird to chew or play with. So I might get some more of that. And we've got over here, box of toys. You could make that. Should I go everything? Oh, then they got this one too. I was looking, for, I was looking everywhere for one of these. Push in their little nuts and everything. It's a bit like a scavenger toy. Pretty excited for that one. Pretty excited in general. Oh, and another thing too, with the branches, they recommend taking all the bark off because all the bacteria and stuff can live under the bark. Bugs and all that sort of stuff too. So you can take all that off. Also, they say if the bark's off, it discourages the bird from chewing the perch. So the perch will actually last longer. But in saying that, if they do like to chew them and destroy them, it's pretty easy to just go on another walk and um, get a new one. I guess. So, first of all, I'm gonna measure this down to see how I want it in the cage, cut it down, and then I'm gonna see you in a minute when I go soak it in the bath.
uh, I cooked out 200 ml of bleach. So it's not very much bleach considering the amount of water that's going to be in the bar. And then we'll just let these soak here. I'll have to probably rotate them around a bit in the water. But let them soak for a little while. Um, and then I'll rinse them off, soak them in cold, plain water with no bleach in it for a bit longer. And then I'll take them out to dry. We've been ripping up floorboards, getting the bird stuff ready. We've just had a delivery from the postie for Declan's new shoes. And he's pretty excited to help open them up and see. He's pretty fancy box. Mm. Whatever that is. The OG sneaker store. We hope you enjoy your purchase as much as we enjoyed preparing it for you. Your order was packed at KFL by Siobhan. Were they what you wanted? Do you like them? Mm hmm. Thank you. What is this though? That's, That's the shoelaces. The shoelaces. Ah, oh, so I just slide them on. Yeah, well, there you go. Put your foot in, pull it, and lock it. So we got Declan a pair of shoes for Christmas, and they, well, Santa bought him a pair of shoes for Christmas, and they weren't the ones that he really wanted. Oh, okay. Oh, all right. <laughs> Every time he gets the shoes, he does a run test and a jump test. Yeah. Now are they jumping ones? Eat. The run and jump test. Yes, yes. I cannot wait to have nice carpet on the lounge room floor again. All through the house actually we're getting a new carpet. Oh, cut the shoelace. Imagine that. Cute, then you'll be hanging it again. What? What do you say? Thank you. Thanks, Mum. You're the best, Mum. Yeah, so Santa's, Santa's the, the best. best, but I have to actually change them. You got my beef from picking out yesterday's shoes. So we've got our branches already treated, ready to go. So what I'm going to do now is drill the holes in each end and pop our hang bolts in. So. <laughs> Going to do it over here. Sorry about a little burnout to the guys who've been playing with their little cars and decided it was too wet outside to use them, so they've used them in the house. So I'll clean that up once I've made, finished making more mess. So I'm just gonna drill some holes in, Dex is gonna hold it. Say about center to me is about there. And now this one. Skinny one. Skinny one. Put it down the ground. Yeah. You can drill it. So when you do this, guys, make sure you've got a good sharp drill bit. I obviously got a blunt one and a hot one. <laughs> Burn my finger. <laughs> okay, one more hole. Now I'm going to get my hang bolts. Oh. Be back in a second. I'm just going to go my shifter. Can we stop about there? Ah, oh, okay. The Karen's. It's not Karen. His name's gonna be Winston. Odin. Odin. This one. Ah, oh, okay. Oh, 
Okay. It's Oh, I don't know if you get it out of my house, but I think it's better. Do you want to use the little baby letter? Yes. Put the little baby letter. Is the baby letter there for him? Yeah. No, In case is... he has a little fall. Oh, you know, we could do that. In case he has to go Spider Man mode. We could do Spider Man. With the one that we got today, yeah. we could go like this. What is this? I know what this is. You hide there, it's a scavenger toy. You hide their um, little nuts and treats in it. So when you go to work, you put it in there, push all your little nuts and everything into here, hang it up, you come back from work and that'll all be destroyed and you would have eaten all the nuts. Oh, that's a waste of a toy. We got Duplo for it. Duplo? Here we go. Chuck some Duplo in there. Can build. Oh. Maybe this is next. Maybe this next. I want to put them all in there. Yeah, let's put these in. This one's summer. It's gonna be a little swing. We won't use the big ladder yet. We can um. We we can leave that one there, Dex, and then like when you want to hang the treats and stuff, you can just hang them off there and stuff. He's gonna have to do some punching bag. Can be his punching bag. Can be his punching bag. Look, it's gonna be boxing one. I think you should put this one in. This one looks cool. It's got a little bell on it. Mm, I think you can put that there. Yeah. No, not yet. You'll we'll clutter it up too much otherwise. So? Got heaps in here to save up to give him. Why is it a bore? Is it Bill? We don't know yet. We don't know if it's a boy or a girl. Why don't you say if he... If, if you want to have a look at where we put the branches. What is this for bud? What is this? Keeping it kind of simple at the start. But then as it goes on... And then we can sort of judge off the bird's what? personality and how it is and what how he like wants. I don't want it too cluttered so we can still get him in and out pretty easily. It's like a... Climb if he likes to climb, we can add more stuff in there. Like but at the moment, until he gets used to us and used to his new home, him, her, I don't know what it is yet. But um, that's it for this vlog. And until next time, you'll see in the next one, I'm going to be building the piano. We've got a couple of Legos for Christmas, us big kids. So I'll be building the piano next. And then after that, there'll be another one out with the um, Lambo. Lambo. So, thanks for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Notification. Notification bell. Notification bell. Wow. So make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Until next time. Bye.